Hello guys and welcome to another video, this is Yagura's Moments and on this video we're gonna talk about a very cheap option, microphone option for your streaming and this microphone gonna be again the Rode Video Micro. In the previous video I talked why I think this is the best option for YouTubers or anyone who wanna improve the quality of their sound by putting the microphone on top of your camera, right? So if you wanna see that video it's gonna be in the description below. Now we're gonna talk how we can turn the same microphone, the Rode Video Micro, into a microphone for our streaming. I don't know if you understand how good, clever and cheap option is that because we're gonna use the same microphone for everything. Because we're using this microphone on top of our camera, this is actually why this microphone is made to be on top of your camera and you can use it for videos, for vlogs or any other content that you want connecting it straight to your camera. Actually, right now, the microphone is still connect connecting straight to the camera, but first I'm having it on a pole and a bit longer TRS cable because I want the microphone to be very near to myself. So with this setup, the only thing that you're gonna need is a pole. As you see, I have a pole here, which you can find very cheap on Amazon with $20, $30. And this TRS cable, very long TRS cable, around three meters that goes down over there and comes back straight to the camera over here. And at the same time, if you wanna go to the PC and make streaming, I can use the same microphone connecting it straight to the PC and use it for my streaming. And also sometimes I'm using it for voiceovers. And when you wanna use your microphone with your PC for streaming, you just take out the cable, the microphone cable from the camera and you plug it in straight to your PC. All right, and right now I just opened the OBS Studio. Most of you must be using the OBS or Streamlabs OBS. So it doesn't matter which program you're gonna using it. By putting your microphone, the Rode Video Micro, straight to your PC, you can find it out in the program, in the settings. I had to go to the settings, to the audio, and here choosing the correct microphone. You just select the microphone of your laptop here. So it's very easy to find it out. And right now the sound is coming from the Rode Video Micro that we connected together. I show you everything that's going straight to our laptop. And this is how you can actually use the Rode Video Micro for streaming as well. And let's jump right now. I'm gonna show you some examples from the gaming streaming that I made and have recorded on my PC. Let's go. And here we go, a small example for you to see how it look like to stream with a GoPro. Right now I'm recording on OBS my gameplay on the game which is called Battlefield 3, one of my favorite games actually. So let's see how it looks like, how is the game. So you can see approximately, let's say I'm streaming right now and you're watching me on, on Twitch. So let's go to the game, let's spawn, deploy, let's go to kick some asses, right? I haven't played this game for a while. Oh no. Ah, very bad, very bad. People coming from there, people coming from everywhere. And I'm dead. <laughs> also, I would like to know your opinion about this microphone and that streaming setup that I'm showing you today, which is very budget friendly setup. What do you think about it? And if you're gonna use it. And if you don't have microphone input on your laptop or your PC, then there is a solution there. There is gadgets, there is adapters, the ones that you're watching right now. You can find them on Amazon very cheap, less than 10 euro. So I'll put all the gadgets and products that I'm showing you on this video in the description below so you can find it. And also if you're using your DSLR or mirrorless or other camera for your live streaming with your PC, then you can plug it in your microphone straight to your camera as we did in the beginning for a recording and you don't need any gadget or anything. Just plug it in straight to your camera and plug in your camera with a capture card to your PC. If you wanna learn how to do that, how to use your DSLR like a streaming camera, I have made another video, you can find it here or it's gonna be in the description below. Alright guys, and I suppose this is the video. I hope you like the concept of using this microphone, the Rode Video Micro, for streaming as well. This is a shotgun mic that normally is made to use on top of your camera, but you see at the same time you can have it for your YouTube videos, for your vlogs, at the same time you can have it for your streaming as well. So that's why I'm using it, that's why I love it. I can use it 
for both for YouTube videos and streaming at the same time. It's perfect. And of course, I will wait for your comments in the comment section below to tell me your opinion about that microphone. I think nobody out there on YouTube can recommend the Rode Video Micro for streaming. If you search on YouTube about streaming microphone, you'll never find Rode Video Micro, I think. But I make my small research. Most people there, which are streamers, YouTubers, whatever they are, they recommend microphones which cost more than 100 euro. I have my notes here which some of them are some kind of Razer microphones, very good but expensive, HyperX microphone. The Blue Yeti is very famous as well and the Shure, uh, which are, they have two brands which cost more than $300. And of course, we cannot compare the Rode Video Micro with those microphones which are more expensive and much better. They have for sure much better sound, but this microphone does the job okay, right? Alright guys, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe for more videos like this and I'm gonna see you in the next one. And let's make moments we can never forget. Yeah.